Rock Computer College. Define quality training in information technology. Adding pictures to your document can be a great way to illustrate important information and add a creative accent to existing text. To insert a picture from a file, first place the insertion point where you want the image to appear. So I'll place mine over here. Then select the insert tab on the ribbon. Then click the pictures command. Then this will pop up. And from here, navigate to the folder where your image is located. So mine is over here. Then select the image, click insert. And the image will appear in your document. Now to resize an image, click and drag one of these corners, the corner sizing handles over here. And you can make it smaller, larger if you want to. You can resize it just like that. And if you want to stretch it horizontally or vertically, you can use the side sizing handles, this ones. So you can stretch it this way or this way. Just how you want it. So that's how you add and that's how you insert a picture in your document. Now, when you insert a picture from a file, you'll notice that it's difficult to move it exactly where you want. I can't move it anywhere at all actually I can, I can only resize it but you can't move it now this is because the text wrapping for the image is set to inline with text now to wrap text around an image select the image you want so this is the image that i want to wrap text around then the format tab will appear and here it is so this is the format tab click the wrap text command then from here choose now for me, I'll choose in front of text and my image will appear in front of text and now I'm able to move it around. So I want you to place it over here, I can place it here, here or anywhere in the document, anywhere that I want to. I can place it down here, then resize it, make it larger, smaller, but it makes moving the image very easy. Now, all you have to do is go to wrap text, then change the format. Originally, it's in line with text, but you can use in front of text or behind it text, behind text. And then you'll be able to move your image to any place, any part in your document.